with Instant General, we've actually got uh, under our AgriSure Traits platform, we've got several new uh, traits that have come through there. Most recently introduced to market right now is uh, AgriSure 3000 GT, which uh, with that we're getting uh, corn rootworm control. We're also getting the traditional corn borer control, but it's also stacked with insecticide or herbicidal traits such as uh, glyphosate tolerance as well as uh, Liberty or Ignite tolerance. So growers can have a choice in the day if they, they're concerned about weed resistance or those types of issues, they can spray either or type of program and still get broad spectrum weed control on top of that. Um, that's one of our newest traits that are on the market, but what we're really excited about is an upcoming trait that we're in the approaching near the end of the approval process and expecting approval in the third quarter of the 2009, and that is called Agrisure Viptera. Agrisure Viptera actually will be stacked with our Agrisure 3000 GT hybrids, and, and what that offers us is a broad spectrum insect control of above, of above ground pests. So we start to get control of things like fall armyworm, black cutworm, uh, corn earworm, uh, corn stock borer, a lot of these different pests that traditionally we're only able to mainly control corn borer. So you can imagine this is really broad in the spectrum of control we're seeing with that. Other interesting thing that goes along with it is the first generation of, of, a, of a new trait that's actually a, a new mode of action in the historical BT proteins that have been launched in the marketplace. Uh, all the historical proteins have been what we refer to as a cry protein or standing for crystalline forming type of a protein, where Syngenta and the proprietary system has actually discovered what we refer to as a vegetative insecticidal protein, um, still a bacterial or, or a BT protein that we're to do, but it's kind of in a different family tree. So really what this means in the day to growers is it still kills the insects the same way, but uh, there's a whole insect resistance management side of it that comes into play. So if one insect was happened to perform undercome resistance to a certain pest, we have another opportunity to still control it with this other protein that we're uh, that we've inserted into plant. So similar to controlling weeds, you know, two modes of action is always better. We also now have that within our uh, Agasher Viptera stacked with our traditional corn borer trade as well.